Hi, I'm Joel Tetzloff with Yamaha Drums. I'm here to give you an overview of the DTX M12 Touch app. This app allows you to instantly edit, change, layer your DTX multi-pad sounds, as well as it gives you an instant view of all the pad assignments on the Multi-12. The DTX M12 Touch app works with the iPad, an iOS device. This allows you to see the pad assignments, and as you can see on the app here, not only do we have names and various colors identifying the functions of the pad, but also we can use pictures, whether we use those from our photo album, or we can actually take pictures and use those. A high-powered function built into the DTX multi-pad is the ability to layer sounds. On the DTX M12, you can layer up to four sounds per pad. If we click right here, you can see on the cowbell, we've layered other percussion instruments on top. And to layer a sound, it's just as simple as going over here and picking a category and then selecting a voice. You'll notice here the blue check marks signify what we've selected. And we can easily scroll through these options you see here. Once we've selected all of the voices or layers for that pad, you can see right here that under the cowbell we have four bar pads, meaning that there are four layers to that one pad. It's easy to signify those types of things around the kit and when you switch from kit to kit, it's good information to know that you have layered sounds. With this edit menu here, you can see we have a great new mixer. So we can mix down the entire multi-12 right here. And if we have layered sounds, for instance on the cowbell, you can see all four layers in one shot. And we can actually turn those voices down just as we would with a mixer so that we can have the output of one pad balanced before it even goes out to a live sound situation of some sort. We have our variable sends here, our chorus and reverb send, so we have a master in each level as well, all your pans across the top for your volumes or any of those effects. And then we also have the parameter settings. That's just another way of looking at a lot of editing functions built into the DTX Multi-12. Down here, one of my favorite screens, you can adjust the parameters very quickly for the middle pads or the, say the lower bar pads or upper bar pads. And here's the triggers over here that you can also change. It just makes using the DTX multi-pad that much easier and that much quicker. Let's look at some of the other functions that we can use on the multi-12. You can see up here we have various functions in different colors. Let's tap on the tempo, that's a purple color. In this case, if we pull this menu down, you'll see the various functions that we can assign to each pad. And in this case, the purple signifies a pad function. If we tap on the pad function, we get another menu that scrolls over here. And this allows us to increase the tempo, decrease the tempo. In this case, turn the click on and off, or you can even do a tap tempo. We also have the effects bypass and control changes. These are advanced options that allow you to control other devices in some cases. Another feature exclusive to Yamaha is being able to play audio files through this new app. If you notice this conga loop here, this pink looking, we're going to tap on that and you can see here, this is the app audio file play. If we pull down this menu and we click on that, now you can see that we can pull files in from our Dropbox, iCloud Drive, and even play something from our iTunes library simply by assigning that pad and playing it. This also allows us to choose options like looping those sounds or holding or even restarting those sounds. Very simple. Another great editing function is being able to use the kit increase or decrease function. This allows us to assign a pad for increasing or decreasing. For instance, if I'm on kit number one, we go to song number two and I want to I want to play kit number two because we're changing songs. I can assign a pad to do that. Another great editing function under this is the MIDI message function. Maybe you have a keyboard player in the band or somebody else in the band that's using a MIDI instrument that you need to trigger. Sometimes we have things on laptops that we also want to use, whether it's something like Ableton or maybe even something out of your Cubase that you want to use. Various options like control change, program change, start, stop, continue. Very easy to assign this. This is a very advanced function of the Multi-12, but as you can see with this new app, it makes it very user-friendly. The DTX M12 Touch app 
also allows you to see your trigger inputs on the back of the M12. As you can see over here to the right, we have all the trigger assignments right here, and we can expand those out to see those, or we can shrink them down to make them a little bit smaller. We can also shrink the screen so that we don't see those if we're not using them to make this easier to see on a dark stage, for instance. The trigger inputs allow you to make a hybrid kit out of this, use triggers around your drum kit, or even make this into a complete drum set with a hi-hat controller and a kick tower. Now we can also layer up to four sounds on those triggers as well. Another great live application feature of the DTX M12 Touch app is what we call the set list or the kit listing. If you go under here, you can see that we have right now, we only have four kits. But say this is my set list. You can name each kit as the song in the set list if you'd like. So if we go into edit right here, Changing my set list is just as easy as dragging and dropping. That's extremely helpful when you're in live situations or you need to adjust the set list on the fly. The Yamaha DTX Multipad has always been a very powerful tool for musicians. Whether you're tracking something in the studio, you're using it for a live performance, or building your hybrid kit around it, the DTX M12 Touch app allows you to do so many things, like triggering iTunes from your library, or being able to layer four sounds and see them all in the same pad very quickly and very efficiently. Download the Yamaha DTX M12 Touch app today. It's absolutely free and it's only from Yamaha.